monitoring is an essential element of Integrated Pest Management or IPM. Monitoring and record keeping are not just paper exercises but useful for effective pest and disease management as well as cost saving exercise. In this video I'm going to show you some crop walking and plant monitoring techniques. A single innocuous weed in a glasshouse can host whitefly, thrips and spider mites. It's vitally important to keep an eye on the weeds in and around the glasshouse or polytunnel or any other growing area to make sure they're not hosting a weed population. The speed of crop walking is best done at about one meter per second. If possible, lift the occasional plant, turn leaves and tap plants over paper. These are all effective methods of finding many insects and mite pests. When doing this, you might find cast skins of aphids. These are usually easier to see than the pest and indicate when the presence of aphids above the level of the skins. A really good tip is to use lined pieces of paper because the lines make it easier to see the movement of a small insect or mite. Other tools that you can use are hand lenses, either a linen tester or a loop, electronic microscopes, and location of hotspots. A linen tester hand lens is designed for counting the weft of clothing, but it is a very useful device. It folds open. Big advantage is that it's pre-focused at that distance, which means if you want to take a photograph with your camera or your phone, you just put the camera over the lens and you can take a very good close-up image of what you're seeing. This is a loop hand lens. The one I have is an eight times magnification and you're meant to have one finger out and use it as a monopod to focus the lens to the target and it needs to be about two centimetres or an inch away from the target and ideally you bring the whole thing to your eye so that you get rid of all the background light and you can just minor focuses with your finger moving up and down to get the best vision. We can now get digital microscopes which plug into the USB port of your computer. They have a built-in light and they give a really good sharp image. You can also take video shots with these, but the important thing is that the image you take is emailable to your advisor. Now, you may have heard of the phrase hotspots. This just means an area where there are lots of pest activity. Some plants, such as aubergine, are excellent monitoring plants because they attract many different types of pests. Several nurseries now use plants like aubergine as a bank for beneficials and a trap for the pests. Monocropping is the growing of a single crop year after year on the same land. Ultimately, good record keeping and using the data help you to make the best decisions on which products and tools to use as part of your IPM. But if you can leave you with just a general tip if you can easily see the pests or the damage on the plants, consider using a selective spray. If it is difficult to find many pests and the damage is minimal, this is the best time to biological control. Mm -hmm.